Hi YouTube, this is Gerald and today I'll be doing a book review of this book called uh, The Warren Buffett Stock Portfolio done by Mary Buffett and David Clark. Okay, so in this book, uh, Mary Buffett goes on to explain 17 different companies that Warren Buffett has personally chosen for his company called Berkshire Hathaway, one of the biggest companies in the world. Mary Buffett goes on to explain the rationale behind why did he even buy these companies and that is where it becomes really interesting because you get to peek into the mind of Warren Buffett to better understand how does he personally select uh, the 17 companies. So the first of the four criteria is that he likes his company with a long track record like this company is really old and has been around for a really long time. And the second criteria is that the company must have a very stable growing earnings. The third criteria that she used is that uh, through these stable earnings as well as a long track record or history of this company's record, she then predicts or she teaches us how to predict the future value of the company essentially and with that you with the aid of this uh, concept of the historical book value per share which is the historical equity per share that is how she determines whether or she thinks how Warren Buffett determines whether this company has a competitive advantage against its competitors another very interesting thing about this book is that Mary Buffett also describes what price did Warren Buffett buy, how much has he profited or lost because there are some companies that Warren Buffett have bought in that she describes in his book and he has made a loss like it spends in a range of 100 million which is a lot of money but yet Warren Buffett is still holding on to these companies in the year 2011. The thing that I do not like about this book is that it's like the tip of the iceberg where she states about 4 or 5 criteria in which Warren Buffett uh, chooses to to buy a company but based on uh, one of the one of the letters by Charlie Munger he mentioned that Warren Buffett used almost 100 indicators so personally I think this is an oversimplification of things and if you were to follow this book it might get us into a little bit of a trouble and with that I end my book review if you have benefited from this book review please subscribe to my channel and after reading this book please please do share with me what are the learning points that uh, you have gained from reading that book and maybe you could bounce ideas so that we all ultimately become better investors. Have a great day.